Hey, welcome to a new video. Although dogs are often seen as loving and loyal companions, there are certain breeds that have become known for being aggressive and potentially dangerous. It's important to note that any dog can be dangerous if not properly trained and socialized, but some breeds are more susceptible to aggressive behavior than others. Today, we'll show you the 20 most dangerous dogs in the world. Are you new to this channel? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And before we start, I'd also appreciate it if you liked the video. Number 15. The Rottweiler is an impressive dog with a powerful appearance that's considered one of the most dangerous dog breeds worldwide. But what makes the Rottweiler so dangerous? These dogs have a strong protective instinct and are very attached to their family. If they feel their family is threatened, they will react without hesitation. That's why it's important to socialize and train Rottweilers well. Unfortunately, sometimes these dogs are bred or treated poorly by people, which can make them aggressive. However, Rottweilers are not just dangerous. They are intelligent, loyal and self-assured dogs who like to work for their owners. In some parts of the world, Rottweilers are even used as police dogs. The original tasks of the Rottweiler were herding cattle, protecting and even pulling meat carts. Did you know that the Rottweiler was almost extinct at the beginning of the 20th century? Fortunately, breeders have managed to preserve the breed. Number 14. The American Staffordshire Terrier is known for its strength and fearlessness. Unfortunately, this breed also has a bad reputation due to reported cases of aggression and bite incidents. While not all of them are aggressive, their strength and determination can lead to serious injury if they're not well trained and socialized. Therefore, it's important to choose the American Staffordshire Terrier only if you have experience with dogs and are willing to invest a lot of time and energy in training and socialization. What many people don't know is that the American Staffordshire Terrier is a descendant of the Staffordshire Bull Terrier, which was originally bred for bullfighting. Over the years, the breed was further developed and bred for dogfighting. However, nowadays, they have the reputation of being loyal and devoted family dogs. Number 13. The Doberman Pinscher is sometimes considered a dangerous dog due to its history as a guard dog and the perception that it can be aggressive. However, with the right training, this dog can be a loving and loyal companion. It's important to remember that the training of a dog, regardless of the breed, is the key to a safe and happy relationship between the human and the animal. The Doberman Pinscher was originally bred as a guard dog for German tax collector Louis Doberman. The mix used to create this dog is still not completely clear to this day. The Doberman Pinscher is widely used in police and military units today. As a family dog, they're very sensitive to the energy and signals sent by humans. It's important to be calm and confident when dealing with these dogs and treat each interaction with respect and kindness. Number 12. A Burbol, also known as the South African Burbol, is a dog with a strong and muscular appearance. With its territorial drive and alertness, the Burbol is known as an excellent guard dog that protects its family and property well. However, the breed is also very loyal and friendly to its family and gets along well with children and other pets. But why is the Burbol considered dangerous? This is mainly due to its size and strength. With a weight between 110 and 200 pounds, the Burbol is capable of causing a lot of damage when it becomes aggressive. In addition, the dog is naturally reserved towards strangers and can show fearlessness in adulthood. It's therefore important to socialize and train the Burbol at a young age so that it learns what acceptable behavior is. A fun characteristic of Burbol dogs is their love of water. Of all the dog breeds in the world, the Burbol is probably the one that loves water the most and loves to swim. If you have a pool in your garden or live near a beach, I would definitely recommend doing this with your dog. Number 11. The Perro de Presa Canario, better known as the Canary Mastiff, is known as one of the most aggressive dog breeds in the world. This is mainly because the breed was used in the past for dogfighting and to protect livestock from wild animals. 
It's therefore crucial that these dogs are raised and socialized properly so that they don't become aggressive towards humans or other animals. The Presa Canario has an athletic body with a giant head and their coat is short and coarse and they are usually black or dark brown in color. Despite their reputation as a dangerous breed, these dogs can also be loving and caring pets if they're raised right. These dogs are generally very calm and do not have particularly high training requirements, which means that they also enjoy lying in the sun and relaxing. The history of the breed dates back to the 14th century when the Canary Islands were colonized. As pets, they're good guard dogs due to their distrust of strangers and territorial instincts. Number 10. The Gull Dong, also known as the Pakistani Bulldog, is a very impressive and powerful dog. They're highly suitable for tasks such as hunting and property guarding, but they also excel as watchdogs. However, due to their aggressive and dominant character, they are not suitable for everyone. This dog requires a strong and consistent leader to be well-trained and socialized. An interesting fact about the Gull Dong is that they are used in Pakistan for bear hunting. Yes, you heard that right. These dogs are brave and powerful enough to take on an adult bear, showing how determined and fearless they are. It's advisable to only take in a Gull Dong if you have the right experience and knowledge to raise the stock properly. They have a potentially dangerous character trait and can become aggressive if you don't know how to handle these types of dogs. Number 9. The German Shepherd is the most iconic dog you'll see on the street, with its muscular build and pointed ears. But beware, this dog can be dangerous if not properly trained. With its powerful bite and sharp instincts, it can create a dangerous situation in no time. But there's also good news. The German Shepherd is a loyal and intelligent dog that can be a fantastic companion with the right training. It's energetic and loves to play, so if you give it enough exercise, it'll be a happy and healthy dog. Did you know that this smart dog is often used as a guide dog for the blind, a search dog, a guard dog, and a police dog? It's an all-rounder and needs a challenging task to keep its enormous brain busy. German Shepherds are also known for their loud barks and deep voice, making them good guard dogs. Their barks are very loud and can certainly be impressive to intruders. So if you want this focus appeared, you can count on it easily scaring away intruders. But let's not forget that the German Shepherd also has a sensitive side. It's loyal to its owner and gets along well with children, and with its soft fur and loyal eyes, it's also incredibly cuddly. Number 8. Did you know that the Fila Brasileiro has a long history as a hunter and guard dog in Brazil? In the past, they were used to hunt wild boars and herd livestock, but they were also indispensable as guards of plantations and farms. Their large size and instinctive protection drive made them the ideal guard dog. But the Fila Brasileiro not only has impressive skills, it also has a unique appearance. With their large heads and thick fur, they look tough. But don't be intimidated by their appearance, as they are actually very loving and affectionate. They are loyal to their family and will always make sure to protect their owners. Did you know that the Fila Brasileiro is also known for its long tongue? It's said that some specimens have tongues that are up to 12 inches long. That's an impressive feature, don't you think? All in all, the Fila Brasileiro is a special dog with a rich history and unique features. Would you like to have this dog as a pet? Let me know in the comments. Number 7. Have you ever seen a Siberian Husky and thought, wow, that dog looks like it's ready for the Olympics? Well, that's exactly what this medium-sized dog was built for. With its double coat and pointed ears, it not only looks tough, but also has a bushy tail. All of this is necessary for the long distance races it was originally bred for. But before you think this dog is just an athlete, you should know that it also needs companionship. It loves being in a big pack and can be quite noisy when it's bored. In the past, these dogs were used by the Inuit tribe in Alaska to transport goods and people through the snow and ice. Their skill and dedication even helped them perform a famous rescue mission known as the Serum Run of 1925 when an outbreak of diphtheria threatened to wipe out an entire community. Siberian Huskies were used.
These dogs carried a serum over 1085 kilometers through the snow all the way to Nome, Alaska. They covered this distance in just five and a half days, saving countless lives. Their heroic performance during this mission contributed to the popularity of the Siberian Husky as a working dog and a pet. So don't worry, Siberian Huskies are naturally friendly and affectionate towards people. They're good with children and other pets and have a watchful eye. The only thing they need is a lot of exercise because if they don't get enough exercise, they can become destructive and bored. Number six, the Bull Terrier, also known as the gladiator of dogs, is a real powerhouse. It's solidly built and has a distinctive egg-shaped head with a Roman nose. Unfortunately, the dog's skull shape can sometimes lead to health problems. The Bull Terrier's nose can sometimes be underdeveloped, which can lead to breathing problems and other health issues. But don't underestimate the dog, as its honey and sting can sometimes be dangerous. That's why it's important for the dog to get sufficient training and socialization. But there's also something fun to say about the Bull Terrier. Despite its tough appearance, it actually has a very gentle nature and is known as a friend to everyone. It loves to run and play and has a lot of energy, so a good walk or play session is definitely recommended. Whether it belongs to the world's most dangerous dogs depends on how you look at it. It's certainly not a dog to be underestimated, but with the right training, it can be just as loving a pet as any other dog. So if you're looking for a tough but also affectionate dog, the Bull Terrier is definitely an option to consider. Number 5. The Leon Burger, also known as the Lion Dog, is a magnificent sight to behold. With a shoulder height of 32 inches and a weight of up to 165 pounds, this creature is a true powerhouse. But don't be afraid because this dog isn't only large, but also very good-natured and friendly. However, don't underestimate how dangerous it can be if not properly trained. It can become unruly and cause significant damage. That's why it's important to teach it all commands in a calm and patient manner and to be consistent in training. If you do this, it can become an ideal family dog and enjoy playing with children. Its innate vigilance makes it a great watchdog that will protect you in any situation. A fun fact about the Leon Burger is that despite their size, they're easy to take anywhere. They are very intelligent and have pronounced self-confidence, making them suitable for novice dog owners. Number 4. The Caucasian Shepherd is a dog that should not be underestimated. It's a serious watchdog that will protect its family and home to death. Due to its years of experience as a flock guardian in the Caucasus region, it's very brave and self-assured. However, the Caucasian Shepherd has a long and interesting history. They were used to protect flocks of sheep from wolves, bears and other predators. They had to do this without any help from the Shepherd, so they had to be very independent. This has led to a strong personality and a great need for guarding. But if this animal is only dangerous, you're wrong. The Caucasian Shepherd is smart, brave, loyal, loving, and will sacrifice its life to protect its family. So if you're looking for a dog that can protect your home and family, the Caucasian Shepherd is a good choice. But be prepared for a challenging and dedicated companion that is not afraid to show its teeth when necessary. Number 3. The Alaskan Malamute, also known as the Wolf Dog, is a dangerous dog that should not fall into the hands of an inexperienced owner. It's a powerful sled dog bred to survive in extreme weather conditions and pull heavy loads. Their stubborn character and hunting instinct can lead to aggressive behaviour towards other animals. Therefore, it's crucial that the dog is well socialised and gets plenty of exercise to burn off their energy. It's also important to realise that these dogs have difficulty being left alone at home and require a lot of attention and training. Although the Alaskan Malamute can be dangerous, it's also a fantastic dog to be around. They are friendly, affectionate and loving towards children. This dog is also intelligent and curious and loves to share their discoveries with their human family members. Number 2. The Wolf Dog Hybrid, also called a Wolf Dog, is a unique animal that has arisen from the crossbreeding of a wolf and a domesticated dog. Although their appearance and behaviour are highly variable and difficult to predict, they exhibit genetic traits of both wolves and dogs. 
Their behavior towards humans is often more aggressive and less suitable as a pet than regular dogs. This has made them part of the group of dogs responsible for most attacks on humans in the United States. Their behavior is unpredictable and can be dangerous, and therefore it's important to understand that these animals are not suitable as pets, and there are many restrictions on their breeding. However, the wolf dog is a fascinating animal to see and get to know. They are often stronger than regular dogs and less susceptible to hereditary diseases. Number 6. The Dogo Argentino was a large mastiff-like dog that was specifically bred in the 1920s for dogfighting and hunting large games such as pumas and wild boars. This dog is known for its white coat, which is always short. A single black or dark colored spot on the head is allowed as long as it's no larger than one-tenth the size of the head. The breed originated in Cordoba, Argentina, and was developed by crossing a bulldog-type fighting dog a bull terrier, and a Mastin del Pirineo. In the years that followed, the breeder added several other breeds, including the Irish Wolfhound. Due to its original purpose, the Dogo Argentino is very powerful and has great endurance. It can hunt alone or in groups and is also trained for search and rescue missions, service dogs, and military work. However, the breed is not suitable for inexperienced dog owners due to its dominance and potentially dangerous character. But with the right upbringing and training, the Dogo Argentino can be a loving and loyal companion for experienced dog owners. Do you have a dog yourself? And have you ever encountered a dangerous dog? Let us know in the comments. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos we've made, click one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.